Yo, what's going on boys? I'm gonna be doing a best of five with Ian77 today. Um, don't forget to like and sub. Hope you enjoy the video. Alright, I'm in my first game. Also, Ian is a YouTube, by the way. Go check him out, show him some love. I'm gonna link it down in the description. Um, this should be fun. He has like multiple top five finishes. He's an absolute god. Bro, I take that back. He just went golem in the back. Nice. So I have no idea how to defend this. I don't play this deck. I just like saw it in the leaderboard, so I copied it because it looked fun. Um, he's probably gonna have a night witch. Yeah. Okay. So uh, I don't know how to kill that night witch. By the way, I told him not to play hog, and he told me not to play axe So there's that. Uh, mini pack out live. No. Okay. I probably lost here. I'm gonna wait a little bit on the ability for my queen. Okay. The bats are building up, so I'm gonna use it now. Um, let's see if I can defend my tower. No, okay, he has enough for lightning, so he takes my tower and I get no damage. Um, this is really annoying. Why do you start off with a golem deck? Um, let's see if I can make something happen here. Let's see if I can come back from this spot. Not looking good, though. He's up a whole tower, and I haven't even touched his tower, so yeah. I'm gonna hog mini pack a right side, and then earthquake his tombstone or something. Um, because I'm pissed. Yeah, I'm gonna play Earthquake here. Hopefully I get some damage from that hog. He's probably gonna distract the mini Pekka though. He plays a Skelly King. Oh, he's playing that annoying variant with like Baby Dragon, um, Lightning, Nato, Bar Barrel, Triple Spell. So yeah, he's probably gonna Golem in the back now because I don't have a hog in hand. Yikes, and he's up Elixir. This is not good. Um, I have no idea what to do. I think I'm gonna go for a Tower Trade here and then straight just go for a 3 crown. Hope that he um doesn't defend my stuff. Gonna mini pack a hog. So this should be tower unless he goes for like a tornado. Okay, he went for a baby dragon, so this should be tower. Hold on. Wait a minute. I'm gonna go for a three crown. Oh, he actually missed a tombstone. Hold on. Earthquake log. Uh, I'm gonna hog at four right now. So base race. He's probably gonna win if I don't take him down right now. Uh trying to defend and attack at the same time oh no okay i lost i can't defend that there's too many bats no there's a night witch there's a golem and a skelly king on my tower and a baby dragon so yeah all right pretty annoying first game but at least i got golem out of the way so i don't have to worry about a golem deck anymore unless he repeats which i don't think he will i'm gonna log him here i'm playing pigs by the way super broken deck so hopefully i win Skelly King in the back. I'm gonna queen the back here. Um, could be Mordor. I hope he's not playing Golem again, cause that'd be lame. Bruh, are you serious? There's no way. Why is he repeating Golem? Oh wait, he played a Hunter. No, this is RG. All right, I got scared there for a second. I was actually so sad, cause um, if he played Golem again, that wouldn't be fun. Golem is so broken. Anyways, I'm gonna play Skelly's on the Hunter. Okay, I actually went for a prediction log, so I have to play Fire Spear on the Hunter as well. So I'm not sure who has matchup here, but my guess is he has matchup because um, even though I have a cannon, which is like a really broken building, he has lightning for my queen and my cannon, so yeah. He also has a lot of defense for my bigs. I believe he has a tombstone. He also has fisherman, so he can activate king with it. Um, He plays a tombstone. Hopefully he doesn't play a fisherman. Yeah, because he does play a fisherman, so he's probably going to activate here. Um, I did get some damage. Ooh, the pigs actually died before they could activate. And that was actually so good. Because if they didn't, they would have activated. And then I, I would have had to, like, earthquake cycle. Because pigs would not get any damage. Nice. Okay, he went for a lightning. But my queen's ability actually killed the RG before the lightning dropped. So, let's see. I think he has a really bad hand right now. He should not be back to tombstone. He has, like, hunter, log, RG, and something else. Oh, no, wait, he has Skelly King. I forgot about that card. Anyways, uh, one hit. No, I get no damage on the left side. It's fine. Even even if he uses ability here, I have Log in hand, so I'm fine. Also, I didn't play a cannon there because I needed it for the RG. Delivery is also such a good card. Man, this whole deck is broken. Like, this deck is like literally put all the broken cards and then call it a deck. Anyways, going to Earthquake it. Um, I need to go for Earthquake Cycle. So I'm going to Queen the back. I know he can Lightning this, but I can get back to a second Queen. So yeah. I'm going to Log here. Okay, I actually played a Lightning. So I'm going to Cycle back to my Queen. 
Ooh, the fisherman actually hit my cannon from so far away. So I'm going to play a second cannon. He's pretty far from lightning, so let's see. I'm going to activate ability, use fire spirit, and then delivery here to keep my queen alive. Nice, that was kind of clean, not going to lie. Um, I think I'm going to pig's opposite. Okay, actually, I'm going to earthquake. I was going to pig's opposite, but he played a tombstone, so yeah. I'm going to activate my ability. Nice, the hunter dies. The e spirit also dies. Gonna log here. Ooh, the queen gets some damage on the right side. I probably should have split the pigs actually. Mm, that was kind of stupid by me. Because if I split pigs, um, the two pigs on the right side would have tanked for the queen and the queen would have taken the tower maybe, but I don't know. Gonna earthquake here. He only has a tombstone. Ooh, that was actually such a good tombstone. I did not see that coming. Um, he played it super high, so the earthquake kind of missed it. Anyways, I don't think I'm going to take any damage here. Hopefully not. Nice. Okay, I play a cannon. I'm going to deliver here. I'm going to log also. Yikes, this is a huge push. This is not good. I have to defensive earthquake. Um, My delivery died. So I'm going to scale these over here. Oh, we actually went for an E-Spirit. If he didn't go for an E-Spirit, I would have just let the RG get like one or two more hits and just let my skelly finish it off. But I had to play a cannon. I had to panic a little bit. I'm still up damage though. Let's see what I can do. I'm gonna queen here. I'm gonna earthquake and then go pigs right away, I think. Skelly's here. Um, activate ability and then I'm gonna go pigs. Yeah, he's gonna RG, I think. Oh, nice. Good call on that RG, but I'm not sure who wins this race. Uh, he has hunter. I'm gonna earthquake it. Oh, no. that No, that's actually so unlucky. Wait. Can I defend this? No way, right? Oh, the RG got a hit. No. Delivery, um, Fire Spirit, Skellies. I'm going to log it back quickly. No, I got another hit. Yeah, I, I think I lost. Unless my pigs get there faster. I have to block that E-Spirit because he can just log it. So, Oh, yeah, he's back to Lightning. That was a really good game. I choked at the end. I should have been able to win that. Whatever. All right, I'm in a really terrible spot right now. I'm down two games. So hopefully um, I can get a nice comeback on him. I cannot afford to lose anymore. Anyways, I went drill first play and he logged at the same time, so this is actually kind of good. Wait, is he playing hog? I told him not to play hog. Yikes. Mm, well, this is awkward, but I think I have matchup though, so I'm fine. I have Inferno and Guards. Both are really good versus hog. Let's see. Um, Just going to Valk in the middle at 10, I think, because I don't want to play a Dark Goblin. He can just log it. Oh, I probably should have played a Dark Goblin. He logged my left lane. Whatever. Actually, no, I can kill this musketeer with the dark goblin now. Nice, that was smart. Um, I'm going to goblin drill on the left side and wallbreaker's on the right side because he's not back to log. Oh, I actually played the goblin drill like one second late. Um, if I played it early, I think I would have gotten some dark gob damage. Not sure though, but I'm up damage, so I'm fine. Um, let's see, he's probably going to hog here. I have my inferno ready. Um, I'm going to fire spirit the ice comb. I don't want to take that death damage. Let's see what he does though. Um, he's playing pretty patient. Could he have a second win condition or something? Because he's playing too patient. Um, I did tell him not to play hog. So makes me think he put in like a balloon or something. Plays a fireball. Alright. So I'm going to Valk here. And then if he doesn't do anything, I'm just going to drill. I think. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm going to drill here. Uh, ooh, he's playing Expo? Damn, that's weird. Never plays Expo. Well, he, I guess he kind of got me um, because I didn't expect the Expo. So this is definitely going to get a lock. If I knew he was playing Expo, I wouldn't go for a drill. But I did get some damage on the right side. Um, let's see. I think I have to go same lane, though. I'm not sure. Um, okay, plays a quick cannon. Um, let's see. Should I drill the left or right? Actually, I'm just going to defend here. I'm not going to drill. I'm so lost. I don't know what to do. Just going to fireball the tower and the expo. Um, I'm just going to do what people do versus me. So, yeah. Inferno low. He's probably going to fireball because that's what I would do. Nice. Okay. Guards over here. All right. The expo should die any second now. Nice. He's back to the second expo. He does play the expo. So, I'm going to Valk at the bridge. Let's see if he does anything. Uh, wall breakers. Okay, I actually managed to defend that. So I'm going to Inferno Tower. 
Wait, I didn't even need that inferno. The wall breakers apparently made it. I didn't think they'd make it, but somehow they made it, so yeah. Um, okay, at this point, I think I'm gonna go on the right side because I'm not getting any damage on the left. There's no point, so yeah. I'm gonna dark gob over here. He should log the dark, uh, the goblin drill so he can't log my dark gob. The dark gob's gonna kill the axe Got a lot of value there. Probably gonna musketeer or something, so I'm gonna wall breakers here. I actually went for a skelly, so I'm gonna um, fire spirit. Nice, the dark gob's on the tower. Nice, nice. So much damage. I'm gonna fireball the ice golem as well. Um, okay, good damage. Um, he's probably gonna go in. So actually, I'm gonna predict it. He's probably gonna. Oh, nice. That was really good. I predicted the expo, but he had a uh, ice spirit, so kind of didn't pay off. But not in a bad spot at the same time though, because I can just fireball that if I wanna. I don't want it though. The expo is like almost dead. I'm gonna play a dark goblin here the dark goblin's gonna finish off the axe bow uh, i'm gonna go for a second prediction here once the dark goblin dies nice i hit it again um i'm in a really good spot so i'm gonna play the goblin drill like on the left side not in the middle because he's been playing the ice golem like that body blocking my goblin so yeah you saw how my one of my goblins got a hit on the tower if i played it in the middle i don't think i would have gotten the hit so yeah I'm gonna valk Ooh, I meant to keep that dark gob alive. Okay, I get a really nice fireball. Nice. And my inferno kills that musketeer somehow. So yeah. Plays a second expo. Ooh, this is kind of tricky. Okay, uh Inferno here. Sorry if I'm going a bit quiet. I need to focus. I cannot lose here. Uh wall breakers. Guards, I'm just gonna keep putting down my tanks, um, and then fireball like at the end. Yeah, right now actually, this is a good spot to fireball because I'm gonna have enough for elixir for Inferno Tower. So yeah, Inferno in the middle, and then wall breakers. I'm gonna try and get back to a fireball. I don't even think I need it though. Yeah, that should be game. Nice. Okay, really good game. Super close. I think I had matchup, but he managed to make it so close because he's too good. So yeah. Alright, so the score is 2-1, to one, I think. Um, I need to win two more games to make a comeback. I'm playing bait, by the way. kind of looked through the leaderboard and I saw like two bait players high, so I was like, eh, why not? Anyways, Fire Spirit Log could be pigs. Um, so I'm going to save my guards. I don't want to play anything right now because it could be pigs. I actually played an Earthquake, so yeah, I'm going to guard to the back. Um, let's see what he does. I can't play my Electro Spirit like I would when I have Expo because he can activate and I can't let him activate. So yeah, I'm gonna Princess that Queen. Um, I don't play bait by the way. This is like the first time I played bait in like six months. So yeah, I'm gonna have to play like Riley to win this because I think he has a big matchup. Wait, Valk? Why does he have a Valk? Wait, what? Bruh, okay, I got surprise factored because I didn't think he'd be playing mortar earthquake that's actually even worse than pigs so yeah i don't think i can win this i'm gonna try my best though um he should be low i think so i'm gonna princess here in a second yeah i'm gonna princess bridge left uh, you want to go opposite i think in this matchup you can't go same lane and then give him earthquake value log value and stuff so yeah i'm gonna electro spirit to make sure i don't take any damage from that queen He's probably going to mortar now. I have cannon though, so I should be fine. Oh, yeah, I'm going to cannon that. Yeah, because he has enough for Earthquake, so he's actually going to get a lot of damage. He missed my tower though, but I don't think it matters because the mortar is going to hit my tower like, what, twice? He unfortunately has enough for Valk as well, so I'm going to have to guard. Um, I'm going to Electra Spirit. I don't want to take any damage on the right side. Um, Let's see. I'm pretty lost here. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna have to play like Riley. Um, do I just rock at the mortar? I'm so lost. I'm actually gonna barrel. Uh, gonna cannon all the way up high over here so he can't earthquake it and the tower. No, the mortar is on my tower. I played the guards a little bit too late. Yeah, I think this game's over. I don't see how I get damaged, and he keeps getting damaged with those mortars. 
Probably should have rocketed that, but I don't... Oh my god, he has Tornado. <laughs> I got Surprise Factored again. I didn't know he had a Tornado, so rip. I'm gonna Barrel here, though, and then just Guards. Oh no, I just kind of fed into the Valk. Yeah, I'm just, like, playing his game right now. Um, yeah, so I think that's gonna be the end of the video. Because I don't see how I can come back from this spot. I'm gonna Cannon to Predict the Mortar. I do hit the Prediction, but he played Skellies. Uh, is the mortar on my tower? Hopefully not. Okay, guards over here. I'm gonna cannon here. Let's see. Oh, the mortar is on my tower. That's tough. Okay, well, that's gonna be the end of the video. Um, yeah, he played really well and he got some good matchups. Alright, don't forget to like and sub. Um, I had a lot of fun even though I lost. So next video is probably gonna be ladder. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Peace.